crazy lifestyle. The Rolls Royces, the Jets. You paid so much just to have status. Randall Emmett speaks out against the upcoming documentary about the controversies and allegations made against him last year in a Los Angeles Times expose. I hate Randall Emmett. It's just astounding that he's somewhere still playing the victim when what he has actually done is damage and hurt other people. In a statement to Page Six on Tuesday, the movie producer defends himself against the Hulu doc called The Randall Scandal, Love, Loathing, and Vanderpump, and slams his ex, Vanderpump Rules star, Lala Kent. Randall claims the article was highly biased and a factually inaccurate hit piece, and adds that the journalist who wrote it seemed to have a personal vendetta against him. Randall also alleges the article featured fictitious and greatly exaggerated stories from people he calls disgruntled employees who had been dismissed. Soon after the cameras go up on the season, the LA Times expose hits newsstands hits the internet. You've said that what you've heard is worse than what's in there. So how much worse is what you've heard? It's horrific and disturbing, and it's why I'm in a custody battle. Ocean Kent has to be protected. It's like really bad. Lala was one of several women who shared allegations of inappropriate and abusive behavior in the piece published last June. But Lala is not a part of the forthcoming documentary, and neither is Randall. Randall claims he declined to participate because it became apparent to him that the film was going to be as biased, if not more so, than the article on which it was based. My family, the people with whom I work, and those who matter in my life all know the truth and my accomplishments. I have nothing to prove. Right. Do you think that for the last nine months I have not been spiraling, I, looking yes, back, I know going you like, have. how the and I, did you not see it? Don't well, you think I, I know, did that? What has been the biggest aha moment since splitting up with Randall? I've realized that I'm so okay by myself, that I have incredible people surrounding me. I don't need a man. In the LA Times article, Lala says that an argument in 2021 allegedly turned violent. She claims Randall violently knocked her to the ground after she confronted him about allegedly cheating on her after pics surfaced of Randall with two women in Nashville. The outlet reported the accusation was confirmed by five people following the alleged incident. Randall denied the allegation via a spokesperson. Lala and Randall welcomed their first child together, daughter Ocean, in March 2021. Nine months later, they called off their three-year engagement and the relationship imploded shortly after the alleged physical fight. How do you feel watching it all back? Even though it's strange to relive it, it almost is like, wow, look how far we've come. The Lala that was on screen was still trying to process what had happened and now I'm just I'm swimming when I thought that I would be sinking so even though I recognize her it's almost like my heart goes out to her because we're not there anymore as for the LA Times they issued a statement to page six in response to Randall's allegations if Emmett would like to dispute any of the facts in our reporting or the information in the documentary we welcome him to do so